Hey, what's up YouTube? It is Captain Shock here. Today I'm bringing you episode 6 of the most elite weapon setup videos. And today we'll be talking about the R3K assault rifle. Now the R3K is a burst fire energy rifle and it has some good attributes to it if you use it the correct way. And just a quick disclaimer to those who are new to the channel. On this channel I do things differently than what you see at other channels. I base it on performing at the highest level and I try to back up everything I say. I love using the best of the best weapons, perks, loadouts, you name it. So of course I am going to gravitate towards using the best attachments, in my opinion, that works for each gun. And these are the attachments that I think are best suited for the R3K, which may differ from other setup videos you've seen. But I can back up what I speak. I don't just talk the talk, I walk the walk and that's important to me. So if you're seeing me using something that looks totally crazy for the weapon, I just want you to trust me and just try it. And you will see eventually, when you get used to the weapon and how it plays, you will see the difference it makes. Now, the first attachment that will help make the R3K Elite is Laser Sight. Yes, laser sight, that may seem so crazy, but just trust me, it works and it works very well for this weapon. You've seen in this video already, when they came a close quarter situation with me, I just hip fired them with the laser sight and they got wrecked. They got destroyed, they could not do anything. It is that good on this weapon, but it is very unknown because everyone's afraid to use a laser sight and think out of the box when using these weapons. And that's the difference between an elite player and just a good player. An elite player will take advantage of what the weapon gives you and what the game brings you. So we know with a laser sight on this weapon, you can absolutely destroy enemies at close range situations and just aggressively strafe them. You will be so hard to hit and that is a major advantage. And because of the lethality of this weapon at close range, you can often one burst them with that hip fire. It is that good. Now the second attachment that will help make this gun elite is quick draw. This gun is very dependent on you getting your shots first and you hitting the target before the enemy gets to engage you. And with the quick draw it allows you to do so. It gives you that reduced aim down sight time so you can get your sights on target as soon as possible and melt the enemies as soon as possible. We are not using a suppressor on this weapon so you're going to be known on the radar when you fire this weapon. So of course you want to destroy the enemy as soon as possible and move away. Grip is not really needed on this weapon. The weapon itself has very little recoil and it's a burst fire weapon. So don't use grip on this weapon, use a quick draw instead. It's a very good attachment and I highly recommend the quick draw and you'll see how useful it is in this video and absolutely helps me out. This gun takes some skill to use. You have to be precise, your shots need to be on target, you have to have good positioning and good awareness because you're going on suppressed as well and you're using a burst fire weapon which doesn't have the maneuverability compared to the Kama or the Erad or even the Kaba assault rifle. It's a very high risk, high reward type of gun. But if you do take the time to get used to it and you take the time to master it and understand how it works, then you will have devastating results. An enemy theme will think you are just melting them with this weapon. How are you getting these one burst? How are you destroying them like this with this weapon? But the gun is also dependent on connection. If the connection is good, you will enjoy using this gun. But if there's a day where you're lagging or the game is lagging, the server is lagging, then you will have some inconsistency issues with this weapon and you may get frustrated. So it's very dependent on that as well. And of course, the top tier players in the game and in the professional arena would rather a gun that is more consistent on any given day. But with these attachments and the setup, you will find yourself being more consistent with this weapon and destroying more with this weapon. The third attachment that will help make this gun elite is Elo Sight. The Elo Sight is extremely important or a red dot sight or any optical sight of your choice. Just make sure it is clear and the reticle is fine for precision because 
the iron sights on this weapon will hinder your accuracy. And like I've said before in this video, if you miss your shots with this weapon, you will get punished for it because it requires high accuracy. So why would you hinder yourself and use the cluttered iron sights on this weapon where you can just use an, an elo sight or a red dot sight and have a clear sight on a target to hit your shots and you will do better. You will have a more consistent weapon. So therefore, you need a sight, an optical sight of your choice on this weapon. Now, the final attachment that will make this R3K Burst Fire Assault Rifle Elite is Particle Amp. And yes, I do know the stats for this weapon. But remember, as I've said before, on a high level, you start noticing things that will make the gun more consistent. You will start noticing things that contradict to what the stats say. Because this is online gaming, this is not a stable environment. It is not a set environment. It is not a consistent environment. It keeps changing with the lag, the latency, where the players are located, all different types of factors. And you want to make the gun consistent. You will find the times where, for example, in Black Ops 3, where you two bursted someone up close with an M8, but they did not die and they just melted you. That is what I'm talking about. The stats say that person is supposed to be dead a long time ago, but he's still alive and he's still shooting you and melting you. So trust me on this. Particle Amp makes a difference. It will save you. It will help you one burst your opponents. When you start putting time into this weapon, you will feel that difference a Particle Amp makes. And I highly recommend it. I pick up the Deatomizer Strike and that's how we do it. Trust me guys, this is the elite setup. It is Elo Sight, Quick Draw, Particle Amp and Laser Sight for the R3K. Now go destroy with it.